just found out my boyfriend has been paying camgirls since we've been together. I just found out that my current boyfriend pays camgirls to watch him masturbate and vice versa. We had talked about his interest in camgirls in the past but I was fully under the impression that this habit had ceased since we had gotten together and our relationship had become quite serious. It never bothered me that he did it before because it was when he was single and I think that's totally acceptable. I have no issue with him masturbating or looking at porn but for some reason it deeply upsets me that he seeks out specific women to pay and have one-on-one -on -one time with over a camera and he also allows them to watch him. I have no idea the frequency, but he said he does it whenever we're fighting, he feels lonely, or whenever he is bored. Which I suspect means pretty often but I have no idea. It came up this morning that he still engages in this behavior and has since we've been together and he said he thought I knew and that I was fine with it. He said I should be thankful that he's so upfront about it and doesn't try to hide it from me. Maybe he genuinely thought I knew and was okay with it, but upon seeing my reaction and how hurt I was when I found out he still does it, I feel like he should have been less defensive and angry with me and understood that maybe we weren't on the same page and I feel hurt by this. Possibly even apologetic. When I asked him how he would feel if the roles were reversed he said that, girls don't get off in the same ways, so you can't compare. He called me jealous and said that I was being emotional and overreacting. The more upset I became, the angrier he got until I asked him to leave and said I don't want to see him anymore and that we need time apart. To me, this would be the same as if I was arranging mutual masturbation over the internet with random men and also paying for it. I am upset and needing space away from him and considering ending the relationship. Knowing his extremely defensive personality, I worry that trying to communicate on this will just result in him lying to me and withholding facts. How should I approach this? He called me jealous and said that I was being emotional and overreacting. The more upset I became, the angrier he got until I asked him to leave and said I don't want to see him anymore and that we need time apart. Make that permanent. Not necessarily because of the cam girls, though that's problematic in itself. He doesn't give a damn about your feelings, and that's much more of a concern. To me, this would be the same as if I was arranging mutual masturbation over the internet with random men and also paying for it. Pretty much. I think if we replace the topic, masturbating with cam girls, with any other topic, it still boils down to, my boyfriend did something that deeply upsets and hurts me. Instead of listening to me and talking it through and coming to a compromise, he told me I was overreacting and I should get over it. The subject doesn't matter to me, it's how dismissive he was of your feelings. That's shitty. Watching porn is one thing, but if my wife got naked for another man that's not me as a deal breaker and cheating to me. I would personally count this as cheating if the topic wasn't discussed at the very beginning also. What a comment, girls don't get off the same, idk that doesn't sit well tbh, I understand why you feel upset. Heck I would, I think this may be a deal breaker for me, but that's just me, I think you need to understand if this is something that can continue happening and you be okay with or whether you will always be thinking about it. I dated a dude who did this and it never got better even though he said he would stop. He openly had a porn addiction and I dealt with it for 4 years. The amount of resentment I have towards him is insurmountable even though we are not together anymore. Looking back, I wish I just would have left. Yeah, I don't think that sounds normal for a man in a relationship. If he were single, understandable. Maybe write out everything that you're feeling. Gather your thoughts, questions, everything. Then come from a calm gentle place when talking about it with him since he's defensive. Well you're right, regardless of money this is mutual masturbation which in most monogamous relationships would be considered cheating. Now that you have time apart it's time to reflect on the relationship as a whole and wondering if he'll ever get it through his head that you don't want your partner doing this. The fact that he's defensive, getting angry, and saying you're overreacting is a pretty big red flag. I think you need to wait for him to talk to you first, and understand he's probably engaging in this bad habit currently. Don't let it fuel your anger per se, but knowing that may help you wrap your head around how he sees the relationship as opposed to how you see it. Oh shit. You need a new man. Only time he should take his pork and beans out is if he's about to use it on you. This is a betrayal. Get a guy who can pound you good, 
be honest, and keep doing those two things. Best of luck. I would also count this as a form of cheating. A red flag for me is that one, he still does it and two, he never actually talked to you about it and just assumed you knew. Also the fact that he got angry upon talking about it is not the way to go. Kind of seemed like a little kid who was caught doing something they were not supposed to. You are not jealous. It would make me uncomfortable if my fiancé was doing that. And I would be heated. Your feelings are valid hun. Don't allow him to let you think they are not. He is paying sex workers for online sex and seems to be perfectly fine with it. No guilt whatsoever. And it is not that big a step from paying for online sex to paying for in-person sex. You are right to worry because if he does not see what he is doing is wrong then he will continue behind your back. You will be forever looking at expenses and statements. So your choice is to either live with it or walk away. I would chalk this one up as incompatible values. Seems to me like he compares this to watching porn. But he would be wrong. Watching porn is a passive activity that doesn't involve an outside party. What he has done is actively seek out and engage an outside party in sexual activity. That is not you. That is cheating. Even if it's virtual and not in person, it's still sex work prostitution that he engaged in. You are right to all your feelings, and he is a moron for not even knowing what this is. Don't marry a man who wasted his money on porn. If it lasts and you marry he'll waste your money on porn. Find someone who doesn't think he can buy a woman's attention, company or sexuality. If you told him you aren't okay with it, and he still expects you to be okay with it and pretty much gaslights you by telling you you're overreacting, then you should leave him. If it's not what you want in your future why stay right? There is no other approach, he won't stop. My ex had the same excuses, at one point I let him know that it had become a deal breaker and we actually separated for a bit because he chose the cam girls over me. That sort of addiction doesn't just go away. I broke up with my boyfriend of six years, father to my daughter for doing this exact thing once. It's cheating. Boundaries are boundaries. He's clearly breaking yours. He's been constantly cheating on you call it like it is. You did the right thing, dear. He is a liar and a cheat. He knew it would bother you but still tried to get away with it by being an idiot. I would never be able to trust him again. It is disrespectful and degrading to me when in a relationship. But, he never cared enough about your feelings. Don't take him back. Chances are as I even write this, he is doing, his own thing. Trust your gut girl. End it. Yep, it's not like, regular, porn as they are interacting so basically cheating in my book and would be the relationship ended but we're all different. Just watching cam girls, is porn. Paying cam girls or subscribing is basically cyber prostitution. He yes, he is cheating by sea escorts. Nope, paying for porn is cheating in my opinion and viewing cam girls is super personal and they can chat with him and give him favors this is not okay for me and I don't think you should tolerate it. The fact that he wasn't willing to discuss this with you and accused you of jealousy is mind-boggling. Dot. Porn is one thing but when it goes from solo activity to interactive sexual activity with someone outside of the relationship? That is straight up cheating. If he is too ignorant to acknowledge why this would upset most people, then don't keep him around. Get a guy with a bit more common sense and respect for you. He's defensive because he knows he's wrong. And the girls don't get off the same comment makes me think he's also delusional. Those girls are almost guaranteed not getting off at all. Like really? It's fake and they do it cause he's paying them. Seriously not many women get off watching random dudes masturbate on the internet. Oh god lol. Listen. Break up with him. He isnt going to change and you'll only get your heart and feelings broken if you stay with him. If he's paying for private shows it's cheating. He might as well have gone to a escort. When their interaction with another person that's he's paying it's cheating. He's been cheating on you and you have every right to be upset. If your boundary is no cam girls then tell him no cam girls. If he keeps doing it or puts up a fight then stand your ground and kick him to the curb. It doesn't matter what he says to defend himself because he's honestly just going to throw everything at the wall and see what sticks. Start camming and see how he likes it.
He's gaslighting you and making you feel guilty. His behavior is inappropriate. One of the red flags when you start dating someone is they tend to tell you the truth in an inappropriate behavior in the beginning of the relationship. It's an illusion so when the time comes when you do have problems relating to the same issues he was open with you about, he's making you feel that you are wrong for feeling the way that you do, when in fact he manipulating you and in time you start lowering your standards and start accepting his behavior which is not healthy. I would step back from this relationship, if he doesn't see that it's a problem you should end it. You're dating a little boy. Move on and I promise you'll look back at this thread and laugh and thank yourself for leaving him. I swear some men try significant other hard to fight the fucking fine line of cheating it's ridiculous. Wow, time to leave the sado. This is not normal. Throw the whole man out. You have a fundamental disagreement about what an exclusive relationship should look like, he's belittling your feelings, and he's spending money out the ass for sex work and shows no signs of stopping. Wow. Suggest you make the break permanent. The problem was his reaction. It was not one based on love or respect or caring about you. It was one based on proving he was right. This is digital prostitution. There's like a billion free porn videos and he decided to pay for someone to masturbate with him. Free porn enough is a touchy subject when in a relationship. But I'd say to wait your chances. I don't know you and your boyfriend so don't do any rash and irrational decisions yet. Wait your chances. Try to make a compromise. Then take your verdict. I'm sorry I know this probably comes up a lot but if you're uncomfortable with this and he refuses to stop then I would reconsider your relationship with him. My ex told me he used cam girls while we were dating. I was hurt, then I found out he spent well over 1k on them. I don't know if it continued after that but perhaps you're missing some huge tips on him not being right for you. I saw a ton of things I didn't like about him after that so perhaps this will give you a nudge to keep your eyes peeled to see if this relationship is right for you. My personal opinion is it's for sure cheating. Behavior like this could be a lack of control. He's bored. He's upset you. It's his outlet. Instead of food or alcohol or drugs he goes to cam girls. It's an addiction if it's taking over his life and if he's trying to tell you your option or how you feel about it is wrong or different to his. You could break up with him and wish him luck or he could deal with whatever his internal issues are by speaking to someone about it therapy and slowly weaning himself off of it and finding new ways to deal with his feelings. Sorry you're in this situation. Not the asshole. I would consider this cheating because watching porn is just someone doing it alone, but the fact that he let other women see him naked when his girlfriend should be the only one to see him that way is crossing a line. It sounds like he is saying that he thought you knew is an excuse to hide the fact that he knew you actually didn't know. And then for him to say that he thinks you should be grateful that he's being honest is kinda fucked up. You deserve so much better. It sounds like he knew that he was caught doing something wrong and instead of apologizing, he made it seem like you were the one with the issue. There is a serious lack of respect here. Yes, girls don't get off in the same way, which is why women never cheat, sext, or trade nudes. Why do men think we're that dumb? We have eyes, we're just as visual as they are, we enjoy variety, and we get bored. Monogamy is just as easy or difficult for us as it is for them, and yet they act like their dick is a reason to look the other way when they behave badly. Nope. So now that we've gotten out of the way that either your boyfriend is dumb or he think you're dumb, let's address the fact that he's cheating, lying to you, and manipulating you. Time to pack it up and drop this one. Being alone is better than being with a boy like him. When I asked him how he would feel if the roles were reversed he said that, girls don't get off in the same ways, so you can't compare. Um, what? Excuse him, I can absolutely get off to an attractive person talking dirty to me over video? Dot. He's not reading erotica or fanfic or watching the occasional porn. He's literally paying people to have one-on-one -on -one time with him on camera. In my opinion that crosses the line into cheating unless both parties are aware and okay with it happening. Plus uh, what the fuck about the part one quoted? That makes no sense. He totally reacted by gaslighting you. You'll go round and round and round and he'll make it all your fault. He already is by suggesting that, when you're fighting, he does it. Oops better hurry up and appease his every whim. I know there is a level of commitment in a BF girlfriend relationship, but you are not married. 
So, you can stay or go, whatever you want. If you are uncomfortable with this behavior, you should leave. He's probably not going to change. He's got a problem. When you interact with another person it becomes cheating. Lol girls don't get off the same way. I thought that's what he was paying them to do. If he's not okay with you flicking it on cam with some guy, then he for sure knows he did wrong and is a double asshole for getting mad at you. Join the fucking club honey. Dump him. And move on. Went through this with an ex. I broke up with him because he wouldn't get help for his porn addiction and repeatedly broke my trust. He's paying to have a sexual encounter with another woman. That is cheating. He dismissed all your concerns and cares more about getting an orgasm than he cares about how that makes you, his girlfriend, feel. I would strongly advise you breaking up with your cheating, selfish and asshole boyfriend. Edit. More words. These girls play a fantasy role for your boyfriend. Their cam persona is not the real them. They are a blank canvas for him to project his fantasies onto them. Your boyfriend has been clear that he is not changing. Your options are to accept him as he is, the good and the bad, change the way that you perceive or deal with the situation, or break up with him because this behavior is a deal breaker for you. If you know he is going to lie and withhold then don't stay with him. He is angry that you are upset because it threatens something he cares about keeping fiercely protected, he couldn't even talk about it, more than he cares about how you feel. That isn't a healthy man.